How has Iran managed to gain influence in the Horn of Africa, outflanking U.S. allies in the process? This is a question that requires a deep dive into the complex geopolitics of the region, from the Cold War era to the present day. During the Cold War, the Horn of Africa, encompassing countries such as Ethiopia, Somalia, and Eritrea, was heavily influenced by foreign powers due to its strategic location and control over the Blue Nile. The strategic value of the region, however, diminished after the Cold War. But with the advent of the War on Terror following a series of terrorist attacks, the United States became more involved in the region. This heightened attention from the U.S., however, inadvertently opened the door for Iran to establish a foothold in the region. Iran formed an alliance with Eritrea, a secular nation known for its pragmatic foreign policy and a history of conflicts with neighboring countries. The conflicts in the Horn of Africa revolve largely around territorial disputes and the control of contested areas. Ethiopia, a nation with a history of expansionism, has faced challenges from various ethnic groups, including Somalis. This conflict between Ethiopia and Somalia turned into a zero-sum game, with foreign powers taking sides. The Soviet Union supported Ethiopia during the Ogaden War, while the United States refused to arm Somalia. By the end of the 80s, the conflict had ended and Somalia descended into a civil war. This further destabilized the region, providing Iran with an opportunity to increase its influence. So, to summarize, the influence of Iran in the Horn of Africa can be traced back to the Cold War era. The strategic location of the region and control over the Blue Nile made it a geopolitical hotspot. The involvement of the U.S. in the region increased following terrorist attacks, but this inadvertently allowed Iran to form an alliance with Eritrea. The territorial disputes and contested control areas in the Horn of Africa, particularly the conflict between Ethiopia and Somalia, became a breeding ground for foreign involvement. With the U.S. and Soviet Union taking sides, the region became even more unstable. The descent of Somalia into civil war further created an opportunity for Iran to expand its influence. Today, Iran's influence in the Horn of Africa poses a significant challenge to U.S. allies in the region. This complex web of geopolitics, history, and conflict provides a rich context to understand the current dynamics in the Horn of Africa. It's a story of strategic alliances, territorial disputes, and foreign involvement, which continue to shape the region and its relationship with global powers.